allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic of which he stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I promise to do my best to treat everyone fairly. I promise to do my best to be kind to everyone, even though they're not like me. If I see somebody, someone being hurt or bullied, I will tell a teacher. Everyone should be, should be able to feel safe and happy in school. I want our school to be no place for hate. Did you know? The country we live in is called the United States of America. Sometimes it's called the U.S. or the U.S.A. Often, you think about our country looking like this on a map. But don't forget to include two other of our 50 states that do not touch the mainland of the United States. That includes Alaska, which comes off the side of Canada, and Hawaii, which is a chain of islands in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Hi, I'm Julie Freeman Moore. I'm a pre-K teacher and my husband was in the army. And this is my favorite uniform. Now it's pixels, but this was my favorite uniform besides the fancy ones. Um, this is my son, Jackson. And this is my husband, Aaron. And look, he's got a beard now. He couldn't have that in the army. Uh, we lived in Kentucky, Kansas, and in New York. We lived in a whole bunch of places all over. We didn't go overseas, um, but we really liked being in the military. The best part of being in the military was all the people we met, honestly, and all the stories that we had. Um, because you weren't in a place very long, you met people and they really got to know you fast. You shared a lot of information fast. Now that we're no longer in, we are retired and we are here in Arlington. One of the fond memories I have when I was active duty is that all my kids were born in different states. I think that's really neat. I loved all the people I met. What is one of your fond memories? I mean, just like the community. I mean, you live on you live on post with everyone, and I think it's really fun. Just like you know, running around having something like similar with everyone. You're all in like the same boat. That was really fun to me. And Aaron, did you have a fond memory of your time in the army? I do have fond memories. I spent 22 years in the army, so I'm a proud veteran now. Contrary to what my wife said, I'm not fully retired. I retired from the military service, but I still work, regrettably so. And one of my fondest memories, as she smirks at me, is I concur with both Julie and, and Jackson. Like, the people were the things that made the experiences, and I got to jump out of perfectly good airplanes. Wow. All right. Go Army Beat Navy. Attention All-Star staff, we invite you to participate in the Wellness Committee's The Grateful Tree. In the front office, you'll see this beautiful tree made by Ms. Walker. Come fill out a leaf and participate in gratitude.